Welcome to the video presentation of the Factory of Categories app. My name is Beata Klarowska. I'm a speech and language pathologist and the creator of the Factory of Categories. Before we start the session, I'm going to review settings with you. We can change the sound scores and we have three different options. So that's one of them. Also incorrect sound. You can set the page, uh, paging as random or disable this feature. And you can decide if you need to show the score during the session so the student can see it or not. You can also back up the data and restore it. To start the session, simply tap on the start. Add your students. I'm going to pick a few more. Let's do one more. Again, select the students for the session. Tap next. And here we have different categories or organized according to easy, moderate and difficult. And you can edit each category by tapping on the edit. And in the easy category, we have very basic categories such as animals, food, transportation, sports. You can deselect all of the categories and just select the one you want. And you should do it in groupings of four. So I have four, but if I want to do more, I'm prompted to select three more. Again, in groupings of four. Um, I have eight categories here. So for Olivia, I'm going to pick where does it belong. For Adam, let's do name this category and let's do the level two. For Oliver, let's work on which doesn't belong. Let's do easy one. And finally for Tom, add one more that goes with the rest. Let's do moderate. So this one, where does it belong? On the bottom, they have speakers on the boxes, which you can listen to. Food. Clothes. And then the child has to put the... Uh, Pictures in the appropriate box. Oops. Tap next. And here the child has to name the category, so animals, and you can score correct or incorrect. And which one doesn't belong? And here, add one more that goes with the rest. So dear. And you continue on. To finish the session, just tap on the finish. You can review the report at the end of the session and email it to yourself. Now if you go back to the main menu, you can view the reports from the main menu as well. You can do it, view it by the goal or by the date. If you wish, you can also delete all the students by tapping on the pencil here. Then tap on the student you wish to delete and just tap on delete. Thank you for your time. If you have any questions, please contact us at info at virtualspeechcenter.com. Thank you very much.